Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. This is your first time here. Welcome host. My name is Asia. So today I am doing a mukbang. I have some buffalo wild wings. I have some fried cheesecake bites. Some lemon pepper wings. Now this sandwich, what is this one? I forget what it's called. Hold on. It's a new chicken sandwich they got. Wow, why is it not showing me? You know, what this sandwich is called. Oh, it's called the Crispy Southern Chicken Sandwich. And it has coleslaw on it, some pickles. It tasted like some type of Italian dressing and stuff on it. But also, I have some french fries back here. And then, because I'm extra greedy, I had to stop at Panera Bread. And I got a smoothie. What's this one called? Mmm. It's called a peach and blueberry smoothie with almond milk or soy milk. And then I also have an apple cinnamon crunch scone. Anyway, I'm ready to eat y'all. So let's dig in. Mmm. These wings are so good. I've been wanting to taste these wings for the longest. I had them to fry them twice as well. Mmm. How y'all doing today? Has y'all week been going good? Are y'all accomplishing all y'all goals? What's up? <clears throat> oh my god, didn't give me no ranch. I asked for ranch. I know that set up this muck thing. I got frustrated yet again. Because I was in a rush and like I'm ready to eat. And I like I completely knocked everything over. All the food, everything just I was so mad at myself. The birds chirping. So I have a really good topic that I want to talk to everybody about. I want to get y'all opinion about this. I hope I don't have lipstick on my teeth. I'm going to try a sandwich. Mmm. Mmm. The chicken is nice and light. <clears throat> Mmm. Nothing to see. It's got coleslaw and everything in there. Not really good. Mmm. I did cheat and try one of the cheesecake bites. <clears throat> it was called my name, so I had to, girl. I'm gonna take a sip of this smoothie. <clears throat> Y'all, this smoothie is so good. Mm -hmm. Put a sticker on here. But. It's so nice and light. I absolutely love that. And especially these hot Florida days, I can use a nice light smoothie. Mmm. Mm -mm. I'm about to start talking y'all, I promise. Mm. <clears throat> Just had to get a little food to me. I was getting hangry. No boy, y'all the type of people that like catch up on your french fries or do you prefer to dip them in something? Me? I can eat french fries plain as y'all can see. Unless they're like homemade or rider fries, I need ketchup with those because I don't know, it's just something about them I need ketchup. But I eat my fries plain all the time. Chuckers has some of the best fries. Wendy's and Burger King, mm mm, no ma'am. 
Okay, so question. <clears throat> How do you guys feel about men, men who are not really judged and everything for their bodies and stuff, how do y'all feel about them telling females what they should do with their body? No. Me, like my whole life, my weight has always fluctuated up and down, you know, but I was never like a um, heavy, heavy girl. And I had somebody tell me that my body would be absolutely perfect if I'll just get a little bit of fat sucked out of my stomach and just keep my butt and the rest of my body. I was like, what? I was like, so who are you? Is that a sauce? Like, who are you to be telling me what I should do with my body and what's, you know, the ideal body? I was so annoyed by that statement. <clears throat> Women get ridiculed every day for what they do, what they say, how they act, how they eat. How they walk, how they talk. And then you're going to say that their body will be ideal. If they just had a flatter stomach or, or whatever. I was so annoyed. Everyone's definition of perfect is different. <clears throat> Me, personally, like after that, I was like, my body is perfect. You know, my, for my standards, how I feel. And if there's something that, I, you know, I want to work on and get fixed or whatever, I will do that. But I don't feel the need to. And it's sad that people really can't see the error in their ways and... You don't realize like the stuff that you say really can affect and offend people. There's nothing wrong with having, you know, a type, but don't try to mix someone else into your type. You just should love them for who they are, you know. Then not only that, this person, this individual. They didn't really care for me like that. Like, they were bisexual. <clears throat> or more so attracted to men. And that was just shock. I'm like, why would that even come from your mouth? I think too much... You know, oftentimes there are too many, you know, stigmas and whatnot. Who is this? To make women fit into a box. And um, we shouldn't have to fit into one particular type of box. We can fit into as many boxes as we want to. Hmm. This is so good. <clears throat> I can't say that this is the only time I've eaten today because I woke up pretty early and I had some eggs and toast. But that was it. Mm -hmm. The earlier I eat or whatever, the hungrier I get in the day, later on during the day. thinking so you know when little girls grow up and they doesn't they don't fit you know this idea of how you think women should be are you going to tell a young girl that she needs to lose weight or something to be perfect I think that, that's absolutely absurd
And luckily, I'm not the type of person, you know, I'm pretty strong minded and everything. I know who I am, what I want. You know what I'm saying? Luckily, I wasn't the type of person that would let something like that, you know, affect me. And, you know, change the outlook on myself. Mm. How I feel about myself. I really should have had some ranch. I just think how that can ruin someone's psyche, you know? <clears throat> so I really want to know what you guys think about that. And how you guys feel about, you know, especially coming from a male telling a female how they should look, what they should do to their bodies. Oh, excuse me. <clears throat> Did a pretty good job cleaning these chicken bones. Usually I don't. My grandma used to always say that we used to play with chicken. Because we didn't clean them to her standards. She would, there was nothing left on the bone, y'all, when she would finish. I'm not that tight. And also, I think, you know, if a woman does anything to her body, enhancements or whatnot. Um, that should be left completely up to her. And, you know, it's for her self-satisfaction. You know, not because of anybody else. Not Don't do it because somebody else wants you to. I always wonder why, you know, so many people on social media get so pressed about what a woman does to their body. It's like, it's not your body. You don't have to carry it. You don't have to take care of it. You don't have to walk in these shoes every single day. So why does it bother people so much when someone else does something to please themselves regarding their body? I don't understand. <clears throat> If they like the way that they look, it don't matter. Mm. This is a good sandwich. Now, I want to say that this is like only my second time in life having buffalo wild wings. Because the first time I went there, I remember, I had a salad. <clears throat> that salad made me so nauseous. And after that, never again. Hmm. I'm gonna tell y'all what I'm probably not gonna eat this cone during this video. I'm gonna have a cheesecake bite though. Again. They didn't even give me <clears throat> how the cheesecake bites was supposed to come on a chocolate dipping sauce. Now that I would use it anyway, I'm not a big chocolate person. If I eat chocolate, it has to have like almonds or some type of nuts or something in it. Like the Hershey's um, bars with almonds, I will not tear those up. But just plain chocolate, maybe if it's Dove, I'll sit there and I'll suck on it, but... I mean, that's not like anything crazy. It just looks like breading on the inside. 
all the up taps again if they were gooey. That would have been bomb. Mmm. I guess I could be nice and at least let y'all see what the scone looks like. It came from Panera. Wait, I think I'm gonna taste it. You see, it has like little apple shucks on the inside. Mmm. That's good. Know myself, I'm gonna save my sweets for later on tonight. I am starting to get full. And I'll probably go ahead and finish this last chicken wing. Mm-mm, that's -mm, true. This chicken would look furry, hairy. I cannot stand seeing hair on chicken. Like, ah, it drives me up the wall. I'm gonna avoid eating that side. These lemon pepper wings are good, but they're not better than mine. I can make some mean lemon pepper wings, y'all. Talk to my sister. Mm. Thank you guys for joining me for this meal. Please let me know your feedback down in the comment box down below. Mm. Let me know if y'all try this sandwich too. It's really good. I would definitely get that again. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.